Meanwhile, a new health scare from China is bringing back memories of the dreaded COVID-19. And India, along with other nations, are on guard. Children in northern China are falling sick. They are complaining of respiratory illness. Many have pneumonia, which has been attributed to the circulation of various pathogens, such as mycoplasma pneumonia. And this is the bacteria as of now. But the good news is that it's not as contagious as COVID-19. But before I move forward, I want to show you a video. The video on your screens here, you can see children in China are doing their homework while hooked to drips. Parents too can be seen hooked to IV drips. All because of this undiagnosed respiratory illness in the country. China blames the surge on an overlap of different viruses such as influenza and viruses that causes COVID-19. However, China denies any new virus behind the spike. And a correspondent, Susan Tarani, spoke with the Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi regarding the rise in the number of pneumonia cases in China. Listen to what he had to say on this. China has a very strong medical system. 最近发生了一些，个别地方发生了一些儿童的感冒的事件，却其实在任何国家都会发生，而在中国处在有效的管控之下。And seeing the rise in cases of respiratory illnesses in the U.S., the Congressional Committee has sent a letter to the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, demanding that it that the the illness in China should be made more transparent. Stressing that the agency could not repeat its pandemic era mistakes. While last week the World Health Organization had asked China to provide more information about the illness. And in India, the government has issued an advisory regarding the respiratory illness in China. Several states have put out advisories to review the health infrastructure. This includes Rajasthan, Karnataka, Gujarat, Uttarakhand, Haryana, and Tamil Nadu. This is after the Indian government asked different states to review their preparedness to tackle flu and other illnesses in the country. Now let's take a look at how these Indian states are preparing themselves. Starting with Karnataka, where the state health minister has informed hospitals to be prepared. Do some mock drills and see the availability of oxygen, beds and PPE kits. In Tamil Nadu, the state is very carefully probing fever in children. Fever camps have been set up across the state that are being held every week. Moving on to Gujarat, where the state has re-examined the oxygen availability and bed preparations, which are made during the period of the, of the COVID-19 pandemic. Arrangements have also been made to create a different ward for respiratory illness cases. While in Rajasthan, the medical and health department has advised its staff to remain alert and form rapid response teams while also asking officials to prepare an action plan for the prevention and treatment of the disease. And finally, in Uttarakhand, the state government has sounded an alert directing officials to step up surveillance in the state, notably three districts in the state, which are Uttarkashi, Pitorgar and Chamoli, who share land borders with China. The officials have also been directed to make required arrangements for isolation beds, wards, oxygen beds, ICU beds, ventilators and oxygen cylinders for the treatment of pneumonia and influenza flu patients in the state.